Hi everybody, welcome back to Let's Talk and you are with me in this beautiful morning, Mira. Guys, I just woke up a while ago, you know, with my cup of tea in the morning and uh, had my fruits. So guys, there are things that make your morning really blissful, right? And that is how you should start your day, fresh wide awake, energetic and just happy to be here in the moment, in the present. But guys, whenever you get this morning wish from someone, maybe your parents, maybe your, uh, you know, your spouse or your children, or when you wish someone, there is something about that wish that just makes your day, right? Well, today I thought since I'm having such a beautiful morning right here, why don't I tell you few phrases that you can use to wish someone good morning in different ways to make their day better. Are you excited about it? Well, I have some interesting phrases for you. Well, let's get started. Let me start with this one. Good morning, sleeping beauty. Well, of course, you text people or you call someone in the morning. We all have these habits, right? We all have someone in our lives that we just open our eyes and want to text good morning to or want to pick up our phone and say good morning to. Or maybe you have your kids in the house running around or someone in the house whom you would like to go and wake up in a cute, pretty way. Well, Sleeping beauty, listening to this term in the morning can just make anyone's day, particularly those kids in the house, those children in the house who would really feel, um, you know, that you, they are your dearest, right? Now, here's another one. Hey, sunshine, it's morning time. Let's make this day awesome. Well, now you're adding words like sunshine and awesome and there's so much positivity in just those words isn't it so when you call people sunshine they know that you know they're important or they know that they're pretty or beautiful and then you're telling them it's morning time so wake up and let's them let's make this day awesome maybe meet for some breakfast or go for some brunch and I'm sure that there will be some energy and some positivity coming out of those people towards your way very soon. And you can expect a nice message in return as well. How about this one? Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. <laughs> well guys, this could be for your partner at home or for anyone when you prepare them a nice morning breakfast in bed and just wake them up to a surprise of a breakfast. Now, obviously there are different types of breakfast that we make, but usually when you make your partner some with some eggs and with some bread, and then you can just surprise them with that tray and just pat them on their forehead and say, wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. And they would wake up to a nice, pleasant surprise of a nice breakfast in bed. Dew drops, you know, that make you feel fresh. Now, I think our wishes also should make someone feel fresh for the morning, right? So, how about this one? Hey, good morning, dew drops. Basically, you're just making them feel that wake up to a fresh morning or just, just something so nice and something that is so refreshing to feel or to smell or to be around in the morning. Dew drops, those little drops that are there on the leaves, aren't they fresh and aren't, don't they feel refreshing? Guys, I think we all have some crazy friends in our lives, you know, we have some really um, energetic people in our lives. And we're so close to them that we can make sure uh, that we make their mornings cozy and warm by just giving them a hug. Now, maybe they're not at your place. Maybe you're not sharing a room or a flat. Maybe they're a little far away and you just need to send them a text message. So here's one for the same. Hey, a morning hug coming your way. So you can probably add a lot of 
A's and Y's in the word way, just to make it a little more crazy and a little more casual and informal. Now this particular one is pretty, you know, pretty different from the others. It goes, morning, good looking. Well, you heard me right. Let me say it again. Morning, good looking. Well, guys, you must be wondering where is the G in both of the pronunciations? Well, this one is a little casual and a little too informal where you just have incomplete pronunciations, just making it sound fun. Well, guys, I'm sure you must have uh, listened to a lot of my videos where I always talk about using different languages to express something. Well, here's the one with just the same idea. Hola, how did you sleep last night? Well, the question is simple, right? But the hola just is a hello in another language, making it sound different, right? And when you ask someone, how did you sleep last night? It just makes them feel special, right? They will share how they slept and maybe that's how they start their day, by just sharing their thoughts. And who wouldn't like that? Now here's another one. Hey morning, it's Miracle Monday. So try to be creative whenever you try to wish someone good morning. Now you have all the seven days in the week, right? You can try to put some creative words which rhyme or which, uh, you know, which make the day sound different. Just like this one, a Miracle Monday will make them feel that Okay, I will probably not have my Monday blues today. Well, usually people feel a little low that the Sunday has passed by and it's Monday and it's time to get studying, get working. And then here comes a message with, it's a miracle Monday. How about a Tuesday? Hey sweetie, have a terrific Tuesday. Now, when you're far away from your friends and family and you want to make sure that they're having a great day, well, you can use this one for a Tuesday, just like the way you were a little creative on a Monday. Now, here's another one. Hey, sleepy eyes, it's time to rise and shine. I think it's pretty cute to wish your little ones or your loved ones with, you know, sleepy eyes and particularly when someone just wakes up, you know that they're still not awake. But when you tell them to rise and shine, they might get inspired or motivated or just very happy to wake up instead of staying droopy and just taking a lot of time to wake up. They will just get going and start their day with a happy note or on a happy note. Well then, you can just end your message or your good morning with adding something like sending you lots of love, right? It can just complete the message and make it sound much more happy, much more positive. Well, after listening to so many good morning wishes, which one are you going to pick up today or tomorrow, whenever? Let me know in the comments section because I would love to know which one would you like to choose. Maybe you can get creative and innovative and put down the ones that you think are new for us. All right, guys, that's all for today. I will be get... Okay, guys, that's all for the day. I will now start my day fresh and happy and positive on such positive notes. Well, guys, I will see you soon in another video. Until then, just make sure you're smiling. All right, bye.